Alright, Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakakwadash. Yahweh is the name of the Heavenly Father, and Yahweh Shai is the name of His only begotten Son, who the world knows Jesus Christ. And I want to give double honors to all the elders and apostles of Great Millstone, who I learned this truth from. And I want to say Shalom to the Hopeful Elect, you so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. May the Most High bless you with His gracious mercies. And today, this lesson will be titled, um, The Feeble Shall Be as David. And I'm going to start right here in Zechariah 12 and 7. Yahweh also shall save the tents of Judah first, that the glory of the house of David and the glory of the inhabitants of Jerusalem do not magnify themselves against Judah. In that day shall Yahweh defend the inhabitants of Jerusalem, and he that is feeble among them at that day shall be as David and the house of David shall be as God as the angel of Yahweh before them. And man, we going to need the Lord in these times we coming in, man. It's Jacob's trouble, man. You know, Esau, he got killer robots, man. Autonomous, uh, what is called lethal autonomous um, weapon system, you know, and um and it, and his army um, said it's more prone to you know killing killing uh, you you know Jake man the tribe of Israel man people of color that's what it said and you know we gonna need these these type of powers man in them times man they got man they got a robot dog with a fitty cow on the back man but he said in them day man it say David shall be as God man nothing to go to um Second Samuel. 22 and we started 29 and it's just showing the power that David had and it said for thou art my lamp O Yahweh and Yahweh will lighten my darkness for by thee have I run through a troop see David said he ran through a troop man and when you go into the word troop let me just go to it real quick a band, troop of divisions of army, man. He ran through a whole army, man. It's a, a crowd, especially of soldiers, man. He ran through a, a man, a crowd of soldiers. It says, I'm start back from the top, um, 30. For by thee have I run through a troop. By my power have I leaped over a wall. He said he leaped over a wall, man. He ain't talking about he jumped like jumping a fence, man. These is like walls, man. A wall, man. Ain't no telling how big that wall was, man. That's spiritual power, man, for you to be able to leap over a wall. And it says, as for God, his way is perfect. The word of Yahweh is tried. He is a buckler to all them that trust in him. And it says, for who is God? Save Yahweh. And who is a rock? Save our power. It says, God is my strength and power. And he maketh my way perfect. He maketh my feet like hind's feet. And setteth me upon my high places. He teacheth my hands to war so that a bow of steel is broken by my arms. And man, just reading that, man, it made me think about um man, I can't uh can't think about what movie it is, man. Well they shot bow and arrows at this dude, man, and he held his his forearms up and they just he just shot it on his forearms, man. Man, King David, man, he had spiritual powers, man. The Lord was dealing with him, man, and we gonna need the Lord in the times that we coming into, man. And if you're not trusting in the Lord and waiting on the Lord, man, you you gonna die here, man. Like a two third. I'm finna get um Amos nine and eleven, and it says, "In that day, will I raise up the tabernacle of David that is fallen, and close up the breaches thereof." And I will raise up his ruins, and I will build it 
as in the days of old. See? And we can go into this word in that day, uh, raise up. One of the definitions, it say, become powerful, man. The Lord going to bless us in that day to be powerful, man. To run through these niggas, man. These wicked ass Edomites and they robot dogs and, you know, Lord willing, you know, we are that number two, you know, get those spiritual powers. But, hey, man, Lord willing, man, because we going to need it, man. Man, that's just going to be a miracle in itself, man. I'm going to end it right here in Psalms 144 and 1. It was my favorite scripture when I first came to the truth, man, because, you know, we was raised that the Lord was just all kisses and hugs, man. But this is a Psalm of David, 140, Psalms 144 and 1. It said, Blessed be Yahweh, my strength, which teacheth my hands to war and my fingers to fight, man. And the Lord going to bless us in that day, man. He going to teach us, you know what I'm saying, our, our hands to war and our fingers to fight, man. And I'm going to end it right here, Psalms 144 and 15. And it say, happy is that people that is in such a case. Yeah, happy is that people whose power is your power, man. Hey, man, we, we very happy <clears throat> that we have the Lord, Yahweh by Shem Shah to be our power, man. And with that, Lord willing, this video was edifying, you know, to you brothers and sisters. And I'm going to say shalom.